Yep, hi all, just a quick video just to show you guys what I'm doing with my, the uh, modifications of my um, Nike Max. So this is what I've got, Replkix models. Um, obviously this all lights up, of course. This part here doesn't light up. So what I've got is I was able to get hold of um, the, um, the kit to um, sort of change it to the light up ones. Obviously these work off the um, lights in there, as well as the units which plug, which plug in and they can go on solid, sort of blue, or they can flash. And these are these are very very fair price. But when I got these for the post, they're they're nice, but they're definitely um definitely definitely not the right um, shade. And really, when when they're actually on the trainer, you know, I don't know if you can tell, but you can't really tell from here. But they're they're different. These are really really bright white. These are slightly off white, and the actual pattern on the um on the sort of leatherette or vinyl is is different. So yeah, these wouldn't really do. So these are basically held together by some sort of um some sort of sticky tape like this. So these come apart nice and easy. So useful for a template as well as electronics outside them. And what I've done is I removed obviously the first one here, which is just here. And what I was able to do is uh, use a, a, a scalpel knife like this in order to be able to cut open um, the bottom part here. So I sliced them very, very carefully so that I could then slide in the um, electronics from one of these um, underneath there. So I, obviously I had to cut out, once I sort of sliced open carefully, I had to cut this out here. So I put um, a knife, shoved a knife in, inside the, the, between the two halves up to here. And I was able to then sort of score down using my scalpel in order to cut this out. And I haven't finished this yet. It's still like a little bit of... um. A little bit of pen on there, a little bit of pen on there. So you find that when you cut it out, you basically have to sort of colour in, colour in the outside of it. Otherwise, you can sort of see the white. But yeah, that's this is just sort of work in progress anyway. Done that. Um, of course, you could of course cut open all of this, but this is really, really sort of properly solid on, and I, I just didn't want to risk you know cutting through to the white part. So what I did is I made a small hole here, put the wiring through, and I used parts. I cut off um, part of the uh, replacement strap to on here. And what I've done is I've just used a normal um, super glue for that, it's nice and easy. And that seems to have held it really nicely. So yeah, so it's all good. So yeah, I was able to slide in, feed the plug through the, um, the hole, and obviously glue this shut nicely, glue that hole there shut, put the wire along here, um, and then put a bit of say a bit of material on here just to hold it in place. And that's all super glue, so that's all it's all nice. Yeah, and that's so that's pretty pretty much you know done. So obviously that's the right material, being the fact that it's the one off off the trainer. So once that's um in place and lit up, that should be cool. So I'll put I'll do a little bit more a little bit more detailing here. I'll get my fine um, sharpie pen just to get around the edge to make it absolutely spot on. You know, do a bit more on that line. You see, so that 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 that'd be fine. That worked nicely with that. So that one. So of course in a minute um I'll pull this one here apart and as you can see these are just held together with this glue. So you know they are alright but they're clearly just the wrong colour. So it would just bother me definitely the fact that it's it's not the same same material. So yeah, so that's what I'm up to. So I'll get that in. You know that that, that didn't take too long, that took about say about an hour I would say just to do this one here. Because obviously you want to do it um, carefully with the knife so you don't cut through anything. And I'll just go and remove those little black marks and then we're all good. And then, um, yeah, that's it really. So I'll, put, I'll quickly plug that in and show you. So excuse the camera work. Cool. Plug that in there, boom. Obviously it's daylight here, so it looks a lot, lot, lot better in the dark. But yeah, you can see that I need to sort of do a bit more colouring in there. I expect when I cut out um, the next one here, I'll probably leave a lot more of the black and maybe just cut a lot tighter around the Nike part. So yeah, once that's, once that's blacked in, that will look absolutely spot on with some Sharpie. And there we go, nice one. So yeah, nice little modification. Excellent, cheers.